well, here we are back in Mitten Rob once more at the uh, Great Dane Reef. I think it was somewhere around here. Not too sure which piece was done. May have only been up to here. <coughs> so I've obviously done the remainder. Come together quite nicely. And uh, basically ends here. Um, the island has been giving its decoration and expanded outwards a little bit at least. I didn't grow the island as much as I thought I was going to. This section of wall is the original original face. So I mean, it's only this bit and this fairly large piece, but still, when it works out at the actual ground level above water, it really didn't change much. Um, stuck this in. Uh, one more boat. <clears throat> Slightly more decorated than others. Uh, built up, rather. Um, obviously didn't put in the front and back. I've just realised I actually really forgot to build, I think, the back, maybe? Some broken part that was supposed to be going on here. Um, there's spawners, hidden, uh, behind these steps. Uh, one in each of them. Um, I did see a guy spawn, who I named Captain Coral, um, but he disappeared, despite the fact I gave him a name tag, which is weird, I didn't know that could happen. Um, I've name tagged plenty of hostile, hostile mobs, it's the first time any of them have disappeared on me. Bats are the only other one that I've had that happen, it's very strange. So obviously none of this, this is done. Um, my intention is to flatten this to create a smoother reef, a smoother drop off, possibly bringing it up and you know curving it around. Um, not really sure what else and how far I want to go. Uh, at least for now, that is. Take a better look at him in a minute. Let's just show you the back half. Always a little bit obscured by the uh, by the kelp. But then there's this guy who is uh, modelled on a whale shark. I didn't want to go super huge. But I probably should have done because it would have made the markings easier. Um, I went through several uh, color schemes. It was originally done with a varied variety of deep slate blocks, some of which have survived. But um, I wasn't happy. I tried representing the spots that are on whale sharks. I tried using the cartography table, which was probably pretty close, but obviously brown, which didn't help. Um, in the process of it, I threw in some amethyst. And although I had some pretty good luck with the um, light blue glazed terracotta, that looked pretty good, especially with the against the um, deep slate. I just decided I preferred the unusual look of the um, amethyst. Um, I think maybe looking at it now. It might be preferable to go through and remove some of the actual um, the amethyst bud blocks um, and just use these ones because um, I do feel like it's a little bit overloaded and uh, we won't talk about the drag that this would cause. had a couple of times where I knocked out the middle and uh, codfish swam out so I decided to leave the mouth open 
I have no idea whether anything can spawn in there still, but he shrunk the area quite a bit. Um, I'm just curious about whether they would even swim in and out. Could be funny if they did. And then when that was done, I moved on to this. It was originally supposed to be just a tall tower with a fun fancy top, uh, modelled after someone else's style of building. Um, but uh, just in the process of developing, I started adding things that are much more in tune with what I do. And the, the, the head at the top is a combination, but um, not really what I had in mind, but that's pretty normal for me when I'm building. The, um, the glasses, they're going to be the default. Um, I did this as an experiment so I could see the colours properly. Built it in glass this side, decided to tweak it, add in the swoosh, and adjust the way that the colours were being put in. And um, I, I kind of like it. Came out nice. And now, once this is done, I have two more pieces of work to do. There's an organic that needs to go in down there. Ruins are going to go in here. I do still need to finish the statue decide whether I'm going to make any modifications to the Hydra. And that will be it. I may leave smoothing out the terrain until much later in the day and possibly leave it to using um, World Edit. But we shall see. But that's what I've been up to for the last two weeks. Uh, I, aside from a little bit of tweaking over at the island, I've added, um, swapped over a couple more trees. There's three or four left to do now. Um, made some tweaks with the dead shell. Nothing too much. But I shall say adieu. And uh, maybe see if I can finish this today.